eku kale o asikuti coronavirus yi um you know as omo yoruba we like to greet on every situation whatever it is that is happening we greet like eku kale now this heat period now i'm going to greet like akoru yo if it is raining like it rained yesterday it will be like Apple Joanna. <laughs> so in this case of coronavirus, so how could see rebuilding your coronavirus? So you know, now in a case where whatever it is that is happening at that moment is not so nice, we are going to back it up with prayer. So after I finish saying how could see coronavirus, so you now back it with prayers like Olon Robawaka SRN Leo Konide Ogobeta Rue de Tata. Bombodeo <laughs> basically saying <laughs> God we help us to clear it and it won't get to us, our family and everybody that we know. So I just thought um I'll start the video with Yoruba kind of greeting as per Omo Yoruba Dada good Yoruba child that I have you understand anyway. I want to rant because I'm seriously, seriously hungry. But before I rant my rant, yeah, at the end of this video, I'm going to be sharing with you four recipes to make your own hand sanitizer. So make sure you stay till the end of the video. Now, what is the problem of people selling hand sanitizers and nose mask? What are you going to get in one? like have people lost their humanity because i'm here thinking this item they suddenly increase the price to about 500 to 600 percent increment it's something that should be cheap and easily accessible to people because it is a preventive measure to ensure that all of us do not die because it, it looks like they do not even know the gravity of this coronavirus they do not know that if care is not taken it's going to wipe everybody off the surface of the health and they are telling us to take preventive measures and people selling the preventive measure materials decided that no ah, this is the time that they are going to be rich or they don't even know that maybe it's that coronavirus that's even going to kill them that money that they are trying to make plenty plenty no 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 maybe they will not even spend that money at the end of the day everybody will just go die no only last last because i don't know where they put their senses people that are able to afford it you know one thousand naira worth of product that turns to ten thousand naira suddenly so people are so rich they can buy the whole container we know all of that now what happens to the poor people who are unable to get at the end if these poor people get infected they will still infect other people because no matter how much you think you try you cannot be 100 percent certain that you won't get infected with the virus like if you are watching me right now and you sell hand sanitizer and nose mask what is your problem you suddenly decide to choose money over health over lives of yourself your family and every other people in this country and you think you're going to go to heaven like that too so we are even christians so as some of you are religious people you know you know you still carry your bible and your quran go to your places of worship on sunday or friday or whichever day that you choose to go you know yourself and you and your conscience is not pricking you alone some of you, you are even, I don't know, some of, some, some, some of them are even dead, they are just, they are deep, because if your conscience is dead, I don't know if you yourself you think you are alive. Because if you cannot think of humanity, you think of making life livable for other people. I don't know what you think you are. Immortal? I don't know. And that nose mask, that I decided that it's going to be super, super expensive. You people that are buying nose mask, you know it is useless. I mean, nose mask is like the last thing that you should be bothered about because what you should be bothered about is your hands. Because if you eventually use your hands to touch your face, touch your nose, touch your mouth, then you get the virus. So your most important preventive measure is not even the nose mask. It is you washing your hands every now and then. If you touch anything, wash your hands. If you see someone sneezing, if you see someone having cold, coughing somewhere, just move away from that person. So your best bet is to use your handkerchief, use your tissue and dispose it immediately. And once you do that, quickly go and wash 
your hands that is it so you people self stop buying their mask if i let them hit it stop buying their nose mask let them hit it and you know there are a whole lot of good people in the country that feel that this entrepreneur that want to suddenly make money you know i want to, i think this is the time that they are going to be rich you know their prayer finally got answered like when they make that money finish if they did not die they will spend the money till the end of their lives or maybe their next generation to will spend from the money anyway so this kind of people good people of nigeria decided that they are going to share their recipes so that everyone can make as much as they want of hand sanitizers and keep it in their house so i was on facebook i was seeing all of these recipes and they were saying just share like keep sharing so i put up about four recipes together so that i can share with and you also can make your own hand sanitizer so that we can all shame the devil you know when i'm saying the devil i'm talking to our people that are no longer human you know the plus their humanity so anyway i'm going to leave you guys right now so that you can see the recipes and make sure that you make your own hand sanitizer easy it is simple and the ingredients are easily accessible so make sure you subscribe to this channel if you are new hi i'm saint dupes oh my god i was so hungry i didn't introduce myself at the start of the video anyway my name is dupe and this channel is pretty new yeah <laughs> i say that every time <laughs> So please subscribe to this channel and I'm going to see you in my next video. Here you.